This is Peter, not your average guy, and that is a never mind your own YouTube channel. And I am flying the Skydio 2, and it's a great drone. What I want to do today is test this boost option more. It's going incredibly fast when you push that button. And I want to see how the obstacle avoidance is doing. Actually, obstacle avoidance is not really the right term. It's more like assisted steering. Because it's not just avoiding obstacles, like it's more like finding the right way. So it's more like assisted steering, like, like what the Tesla has. And there's a line of trees over here. <laughs> Perfect situation to test that it's a dead-end street so shouldn't be a problem I'm just gonna fly around get the hang of the drone a little bit more there is some wind there Wow Put the camera up a little bit more and um, that's like that and that's like that. What shall we do? Shall we immediately fly like through these trees over here? Like like full speed ahead, like normal speed, you know, and then like boo doing it like this. You see? <laughs> I would never do that with any other drone. Okay, so that's when you do that at normal speed. And now... We're gonna have a look. How is this going to look like? I don't think I want to do the, the entire row of trees with full speed. I think I first want to do like in between those two trees, like, like this, right? And then I push the boost button and I say forward. And then it does it does break and there it goes wow so it it's not going between those trees like full speed which which is good of course and it's going so fast <laughs> that i have to keep track of that thing okay so 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 that's when it sees obstacles it's 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 not going full speed through between those obstacles but it is uh slowing down which, which makes sense of course so let's do that again like here um, i'm gonna push the boost button and forward and then it wants to go and then it slows down and then it goes fast enough but it's 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 going pretty smooth you know like like it does make sense what it's doing so it's i think it's even better to to just slowly go through here like what you would normally do and then when you're through it you boost it and why is it going up so much am i doing that maybe maybe i'm doing that this needs some practice to get fluids stuff from this right 
fluid shots, I mean. So, it won't go full speed through here. It won't do that. It sees obstacles, it will slow down. Now you're going straight into that tree, but still, you know, and then, and then I, for instance, I do this and then I take the boost button and then it's like, ooh. Yeah, I think, I think when I push the boost button, I also, but I have to say the screen is lagging a little bit. It's not, sometimes it falls behind. When it's at this speed, you know, when it's, when it's going slow, it doesn't matter that much. But when it's as, at this speed and it lags like for a fraction of a second, then it's a little bit like, okay, is everything still all right? You saw, see, this, this is so cool. I just fly in between these trees and it just finds the path through, through the branches. I want to do something like a distance test because I know it's not going to be much. They say one and a half kilometers. This is the antenna, this thing. So I think I'm going to stand over there and, and let's see how far this thing can get. I would say, let's do that like, like boosting. So there we go. Wow. <laughs> Going up a little bit. High winds, it says. So... This is like um, 0.6 kilometers. high winds but I have to be careful because uh, I only got 29% battery so let's let's just first do one kilometer it still goes very well 28% battery and I'm at one kilometer. I think um, when it's 20, I will turn back for sure. All right, 1.1. It's doing pretty well actually. 25, it wants to come back. Oh no, it says just, just, just yellow return limit reached 1.3 kilometers return. All right, so, oh, it flies backwards. <laughs> what is that? It flies backwards. Can I turn it now? This is just uh, flying backwards. And it's, it's 10 meters per square second can I boost it no I cannot <laughs> it 
<laughs> it's flying backwards. <laughs> Connection regained. That's because I'm walking. It's flying backwards, man. That's funny. But 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 in fact, it is nice because um, it's nice to have shots like that. You know, the only other way you can do this with another drone is like reversing the video. But this one is just flying backwards and for the drone it doesn't matter. It has a 3D map of the environment. It will avoid obstacles anyway. Let's see if I can let it go down. No, it's just fully autonomously flying back uh, 300 meters and I'm at the 18% I think I do want to regain control when it's about here because I don't want it to land on the car I can hear it already well there it is all right so um, I'm gonna have it uh, go lower and then uh, it should be able to land here yeah you can do it all right can I steer it while it's landing? No, I cannot. All right. It's doing it. All right. All right. Well, that's it for another episode with the Skydio 2. So it's not even going 1.5 kilometers. It said maximum limit reached at like 1.3. It seems like there is a physical limit. but the connection is very good i did not lose connection meanwhile well then you know what what you can do how far you can go i'm gonna put it off 11 percent see you on the next video guys